Republicans. How do you I, define? Are you a Bush Republican? No, I think I'm, I'm really the people that I do best with are the people that drive the taxis. You know, wealthy people don't like me because I'm competing against them all the time and they don't like me and I like to win. The fact is, I go down the streets of New York and the people that really like me are the taxi drivers and the workers, etc., etc. What's the downside of being part of the 1% of the richest people in America, especially when you're trying to reach the middle class? The funny thing is, I'm a rich guy, but I have this great relationship with the working people of this country. I have to remind Ted Cruz that Teddy Roosevelt was also from New York, as many other people. <laughs> Listen, Donald Trump, to me, is the last hope for America. I don't want nuance, I want bold colors, red, white, and blue. America, I have seen, Megan, Adeg, in the last several decades, absolutely fray and decline. When I saw those guys on the boats, on their knees, I mean, that says a picture about America that I haven't seen ever before. And I think we need Donald Trump right now. The country needs him. And he's the only candidate for me, for me, that can stand up to the establishment, to the left and the right. And I've got to tell all of you something. People that I've talked to, even last night, I was out on Long Island last night, Democrats, not one or two, but many, are voting for Donald Trump, as well as, the, as, as Republicans. I've seen this all over the place. So I think there's a big, big movement happening. And I've got to say that, uh, you know, we need him. With such vast wealth, how difficult will it be for you to disentangle yourself from your business and your money and prioritize America's interests first? Well, it's an interesting question because I'm very proud of my company. As you too know, I built a very great company. But if I become president, I couldn't care less about my company. I want to use that same up here, whatever it may be, to make America rich again and to make America great again. I have Ivanka and Eric and Don sitting there. Run the company, kids. Have a good time. I'm going to do it for America. <laughs> <laughs>